hi and welcome back to my channel. We are playing Red Dead Redemption 2. Um, we'll just get started. <clears throat> so I'm, felt, I'm recording this part and the previous part on the same day. I'm just doing it in bulk. Um, I just had fleets on me. Um, last time, well, <laughs> a wee while ago, for me anyway. Um, so we did a mission we went to go do the molly mission and it ended up being uncle had information about a car and he wanted arthur to do it and bill and um let not lenny um charles went to go help um it turned out that they were robbing one of cornwell's like I don't know what it is, carriages. Um, so there was tons of men, we had to go hide. Then there was a huge shootout <coughs> and uncle is an empty. Um, and then we did the grey mission. Um, so we met Bo Grey, learned a little bit about like the greys and Turns out Bo is in love with Penelope, who's a brave weight, and they're at war with each other. <clears throat> so they were like sending letters through Arthur to each other, and then um, the women of Rhodes were journal journaling because <laughs> because journal came up, and um, the women of Rhodes were doing a protest to get voting rights, and Penelope was there and. Um, Bo was worried that something bad might happen to her, so here we are. We are here. Arthur's very handsome. Not that one. I wonder how you could do these ones, see? Hey? Huh? What's this one? Oh. Investigate the homestead. And the Grizzlies. Where's the Grizzlies? Right, wait a minute, I wanna check where the Grizzlies is. <coughs> so way up here. Oh, so somewhere here, that's massive. I don't know if I want to go and find. Right. So I read that one. Read that one, I think. Oh, is that it? Oh, did I? Actually, wait, wait a second. Nope, I've done it wrong again. <clears throat> this is what confuses me. Like, I do the chapters. This is the page. Sadie. So, wait, wait, no, no, wait, no, no. So, read this chapter. Yeah, we read that one. Read th this one. Yeah. <clears throat> Roads. I think we've read this one. Sorry, I'm spending like four minutes looking at this. Well, not four minutes. Um. Dirty, yeah. I've done that. Sadie, yup. Ryan, yup. Did that one. <laughs> yep. <clears throat> that emerald. Oh. 
That emerald was about as real as a zebra and worth a whole lot less. Seems Miss Margaret made idiot out of all of us. What did I expect? A man who dealt in fake tigers gave out real gems. Oh, Arthur. Mr. Margaret. Oh, can I rest actually? Oh, okay, never mind. Yep. We're not resting, we're, we're getting on the horse. Um, okay. Let's go up here to Kiel and we'll do Lenny's one first. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Right, so let's hope yeah. I don't die. Here's a carrot for ya. I'm sorry, right, I'm out, I'm out, I'm away. I'm going. All right. Oh man, I'm getting out of here. Am I not supposed to be in here? Is this like the brave place? Oh, yeah. <sighs> okay, well, I'm going, right. I'm getting on the main road. Ooh, this is nice. Look at the trees. No time for tricks. Probably yep. Arthur, um, Charles, Lenny. John's okay. I like Abigail. I like Dutch as well. I like Hosea. I really like Hosea. Um, and I like Karen. Karen's really nice. And uh, Javier. Right, Lenny. Maybe I should go fishing. Bill's all right. Hello. Hello, Arthur. So you told Jose about the moonshine? Yes. He's got like some Bill. plan cooking. And Sean. I love Sean. And Reverend. Yeah? Arthur? Yeah? I don't understand that lawman um, get up. Tilly? Hello? A okay. Swig, Arthur. Tilly showed me though. Right. Set that on. <clears throat> right, cool, cool, we're setting. Tilly? Where'd you go? Oh there you are. Right. Uh, Mr. Morgan. My, my lady? My lady. I'm clean, okay? Don't come after me. Yes, yes. Arthur. I'm coming. Tilly. Hey, Where's my mouth? I have to speak to Tilly. Get out of here. Jose and John are looking for you. They went out to the moonshine stash, said you yeah. knew where that was. They was planning a visit to the Braithwaite place, but Don needs to do something for Dutch now, so Hosea wants you to join him instead. <sighs> Seems to be a lot going on. Yeah. You're telling me. Okay, okay, thank you. Thanks. Right. I was trying to talk to... Oh, Tilly, I'm not playing dominoes with you. Sorry, but no. Alright. <laughs> oh, okay. Is this, uh... This must be a chore that we need to do. Okay. <clears throat> Move the hay. 
Oh, to the horses. Do you want to see all these people sitting on their like bums? What are they doing? I'm going out making us money. All of this. Why can Uncle be doing this? Here. My little horses. Okay, not this bit then. The other pay, I guess. <coughs> I need to rest. Where's my bed? Mm. Right. Let's I'll grab this one. Sorry. It's really close to there. Um, I'll go put this one over here. What do they do? They just... Um... Okay. Who are you? Oh, you're at Abigail. Never mind. It looked like they were, like, floating in the middle of the, um... Like, in the middle of the ground. Right here. Little horses, I have he for you. Okay. <clears throat> there you go. I'll feed you. Since no one else will, you know. Because I'm a nice person. Oh, hey, Charles. Hey. Arrows. What are you working on? Ooh. Fire arrows. Interesting. Mm. You give me a bottle of moonshine okay. and I'll make you some. Moonshine? Mm -hmm. Whiskey do? No. It has to be moonshine. Whiskey oh, is strong okay. enough. Okay. Okay. Thank you. What's My this? Pleasure. Can I read this? Oh, can oh oh I can. Okay. Who's laughing? Oh, chair of Arthur. <laughs> My dear Leonard, it is only three days since you and your mother stood on the platform. Switch. I'm sure I read this. Yeah. That's Leonard's dad. Right, can I wash my face before she like grabs me? No. Okay, I guess not. Maybe here. No. <coughs> okay. Hello, Abigail. Arthur! Oh, Arthur! You need a bath. It's cologne. <laughs> it's liquor. It's cologne. <laughs> From cologne, Germany. <laughs> Oh, I, I just had a few nips, Arthur. I'm not drunk. I'm just... <laughs> <laughs> you know, you ought to try sometime. Drinking? Happiness. Try happiness. Just, just a little. <laughs> okay, you're funny. All right, there's something over here that needs to get done. Oh, oh it's maybe this, actually. Is that... Pete Pearson's wagon. Okay. Sorry, I spent like 13 minutes doing chores. <coughs> Thanks, Arthur. Pearson was moaning about that. Oh, it's alright. I'll do it. Miss Gaskell. Hello. There we go. So, if you do like chores around the area, Arthur? like the camp, you get quite good things. <gasps> That's good then. Oh, no. Pick it up. Don't stand on it. <coughs> right. We'll take it over here. See? Arthur is just nice. Oh, there's Sadie. Look at her. Hello. Where is this to go? Oh, in here. Indeed. Hey, Sadie. What's going on with your hair? Hey, I didn't tell Dutch about the little diversion on our supply run. 
Why not? I'll fight any time and any place. Yeah. What's with her boss. hair? <laughs> it looks like she's like. Let me. Sadie, stop! I'm trying to look at your face. Sadie, what are you doing? Look, her hair was like in her face. Okay. <laughs> right. I'll do one more chore. I'm sure there was something. Oh, hey, Arthur. What oh, you want, God. Micah? Nothing. I'm just being civil, my uh -huh. brother. Well, well hello there. You really are a very charming man, aren't you? Say the same about you. Michael. Yeah. Who's this? Charles. Right, let me just see who this person is. Oh, Lenny. Oh, it's Lenny. You got a lot on? Um, you yeah, kind of. That's fine. Ah. Uh. Just hunting for all this hillbilly gold that Dutch and Hosea seem to think is out there just waiting to be stolen. <laughs> Why? I got something. Could that be good. Yeah. yeah, I was in Rhodes talking to some of the colored folk. They said there's a gang of fools holed up in the swamps east of here who think they war ain't never ended. The Civil War? Yeah, apparently it's still raging in these fools' minds 30 years later. Jeez, okay. <laughs> that ain't my point. These ignorant fools are weapon Ooh. dealers. And in their dealings, sometimes sit on a decent pile of cash. Yeah, been selling weapons to Cuba and South America for years. Anyway, the old boy I was talking to reckoned there might be a bunch of cash just sitting around. And failing that, maybe a nice stash of weapons. With just a bunch of crazies, Gardner? Exactly. Mm. Well, okay. Let's go then. Worth taking a look at least, isn't it? That was my thinking. Said it was at some place called Shady Bell. Deep in the Shady woods. Bell. Okay. Good. <laughs> okay. Come on, then. Oh, I thought I was moving there. I wasn't. All right, then. Let's go oh. rob some food. Hey, okay, Charles. I might go for a simpler look like Lenny's. I like what he's wearing for the black trousers and white shirt and the. Um. Gracies. Oh, 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 okay. Come Let's on, go, then. Boy. Come on. Okay. It's this way. All on me. right. Right. Oh, 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 gosh. See, this horse, he has a mind of his own. All right, I'm coming, Lenny. Don't worry. You uh, recovered yeah. from your <laughs> hangover. <laughs> You know, I might have met these crazies before. Right. You've been drinking again? <laughs> no. Well, yes, but no, that's not how I might have met them. I think some of them harangued me and Sadie when we were coming back with supplies. Mrs. Adler? Yeah. And Mrs. Adler did just fine. More than fine, actually. She's terrified. <laughs> but I got a notion these fellers is one and the same. Yeah, we won't find no shortage of angry Peckerwood idiots yeah. in the state of Lamorne. That's for sure. Is it really that different in this state? We haven't come far. It seems like it is. These boys got a manner about them, but I haven't necessarily noticed. All respect, Mr. Morgan. No, you, you wouldn't. wouldn't notice. Might call you a nigger lover. They see us riding like this. But most of it is a... A glance or How a word. How did you never saw it? That, we literally a saw a night. group of men. Well, out west is... Out west is out west. And you're all who you yeah. are. Right. Decent folks. But some places down here, they judge different. Yeah. Well, Anna, I guess it can't be so easy for you, Lenny. No, I can't imagine what it's like. Sorry you're caught up in this. Well, I guess their gold's still shining. And their guns still shoot. <laughs> so I'm game for robbing any and every one of these bastards for yeah. all they got. Let's do it. <laughs> okay, then. Plus, it beats being lynched back in Blackwater with all of you yeah. by my side. I guess it does. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, I don't like 
to get too far ahead because you're going to lead it. Feels like we're close. It's a rundown old plantation okay. house down in the bayou somewhere. Let's take it slow. Be cautious. If, like you say, these crazies are sitting on weapons, we're gonna wanna strategize a little before yeah. getting shot. Yeah, we don't wanna just go ahead and all comes the blazing. <laughs> they said find the old battlefield and keep on going. Yeah, I've been here before. I can see oh, the wrecked gosh, old this. Civil Can War this? weaponry. Where are the wrecked old Civil War holdouts? You see yeah. that church up ahead? They're supposed to use it as an oh. outpost. Heard they got men going between here and the big house oh. all day. Okay. Okay. Wow. Look at this. this is... Look at this field. <laughs> Imagine getting caught up in a fight like I this. Don't yeah, I don't care to. No. Right, we may need to go hunting as well. Okay, go, go, go. Hold those reins down. Let's just take a look around the place. Okay. I hear you. Uh, it doesn't look no. like anyone's here. We don't know that for sure. Let's have us a nosy. Okay. Oh, an old church find it interesting you Not following sure. back there all right okay i'm coming hear that someone's on the track okay. oh yeah look there yep the wagon let's see where he's going you're on me now right behind okay. you let's keep our distance just two fellers out on the road. Hey, that looked like dynamite in the back there. It looks like we're on to something. Jeez, oh, dynamite? Ooh. Oh, crap. Okay. Come on, Lenny. I think I see something. Oh. Into the avenue oh, yeah. between the trees. Might be it. Might be Steady. It. Keep it steady. Hey, big plantation house. <laughs> Must be Shady Bear. I reckon we can leave our mounts up there, off okay. the trail. Oh, Good enough to me. Right, right, come here. Oh, no. Lead you. Come on, this way. Oh, come on, over here. Lenny. Come on. We can get a view on him from that wall. Oh, up yeah, there. yeah. Bring your side okay. of rifle, okay? I'm from the other side. Um, carving Lannister. Oh, it's right there. Never mind. You get in cover there. Okay. Alright, I need this. Where's he going? Now you go here. Okay. Oh, Jump up. I don't know. Oh no, my horse is following me. I can't really see you. <laughs> get into cover though oh there we go right you see yeah let's see one yes two yes well, there you're all right and they're armed yeah. almost a militia there's quite a lot hey move that 
scope over to the right. You ain't seen anything worth shooting or stealing? Can you look again for me? Tennessee, why are you following me? Point your scope up oh. a little. Okay. Look over to the left. Oh. I know dynamite crates when I see it. We got something, right? Oh, we got something. We can hit them head on, fight them honest. Or you could go down there acting friendly. Friendly? He can't With do these that. Bugs? Just draw them into one spot. Then I'll start shooting. Well, that might be the dumbest idea I've ever heard. But hey, I'm always up for performance. I'm gonna, gonna shoot the dynamite. I don't want to hit him head on. You save your play acting for Jose and the girls. <laughs> Fine by me. Waiting on you. Oh! Hey! You ah! Here I go. Get down! They might be on the way. Now let's grab okay. something and get out. Sounds like a plan. Okay. These fellas dealing off. There might um. be guns in these wagons. This ain't worth taking. I don't know what's worth taking. What was that? I got Jen. Oh, yeah. And Kentucky bourbon. This one looks good. Search okay. it. This one. Right. Okay. I can't. I think I we should know. search the crates. I'm trying to get up. up. Oh, okay. There we go. Right. Okay. Here. Come on. Ooh. This is full of new rifles. We can sell yeah. them, right? We sure can. We'll check the rest later. Now, come on. Right, so let's go. Let's go, let's go. Get this okay. back to camp. Yep. Right. You ready? Get here. Probably gonna get chased. I can't believe you took all this. Go, go, I'm going! 
Because I will crash, all right? I am not the best hey, driver. Okay, keep a cool head. What's the black fella doing coming out of Shady Bell? In one of our wagons. Um. We was uh, doing some business with your brothers back there. You don't look like any kind of folk we deal with. Our business was conducted to the satisfaction of all parties. Until now, that is. Nope. No. Something don't feel right about this. Not him and not you neither, Yankee. Get these lying bastards! Yep. Leonard, Leonard, Leonard. I'm looking, all right? I can't see anyone chasing us. I should think we're out of the woods then. Oh, so the letter <laughs> was for him. Boy, oh boy. Uh, <laughs> you did I good. Leo Leo we Paul. did it. Well, let's get to camp before saying anything like that. I know Sean's been bringing in quite a lot lately, and I wanted to. <sighs> it's good to have something to show like this. Sean's a loudmouth brag. Don't worry about what <laughs> Sean does. Hey, I like him, you know? Well, so do I. <laughs> Here's my better judgment. Just, you worry yeah. about you. He wasn't on Leviticus Cornwall's train with me. We had to dig him out of Blackwater. But, and no, but nothing. Me and Dutch, and everyone who counts, we know what you do for this oh. game. You notice. Keep it up. You're gonna start seeing things change for you. Okay, then. Aww. Okay. That's Thank really you, nice. Yeah. Hey, the camp's in these trees up here. Let's get there. Oh, is that not the barn that we, uh... Oh, you left the tap. Um, the barn that we burned down. Well, we never burned it down. Cornwell's men burned it down. Arthur, Lenny, coming back. Good job, Lenny. These are fine rifles. Right? I'm gonna keep one. Oh, just for nice. me. Hey. I always enjoy riding with you, kid. <laughs> yeah, me too. You know how to fight. Hey, you too. He's a lot if I'm Anytime, I do Arthur. like Lenny. Nice. So we got a new baby. Oh, what was it? Bolt action rifle. Awesome. Right. Oh no. Oh no, we're fine. I just need to. Oh, hello, Uncle. Hey, you're not Uncle, you're Bill. Williamson. Bill. Arthur. Who are you? You're an Uncle. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. Okay. Sheriff Arthur, everybody. <laughs> you okay, Uncle? Yeah, I'm gonna do some sniffing around, see if I can drum up <laughs> some leads. Well, do it quietly. Yeah, right, okay. Look out, old. <coughs> so we'll go to Jose. I'll do this quickly. Um. Man. I really need to rest, actually. Can I rest? No. I thought you could rest. Oh, wow. oh, do you know what I need to do? Is find a fence so that I can sell that gold. Um, I don't know where they are yeah. though. Wait a minute. Index. So let's see. Bounty, Domino's, Vision. Donate to camp. Oh, there. Right, so where's the closest one? In row 
oh it's okay and then there's a Gwen Hughes okay alrighty right let's go this way Selling it back to where it came from. Why? I ain't got a market for it. They made it. They must have someone to sell it to. <coughs> Stuff look kind of lonely out here. I think we'll cut ourselves a deal. Uh, I get you. You and Dutch was just doing your duty when you requisitioned it. Now I'm doing mine. All right. I should get Hi, going John. now. I'll leave you too. Okay. Good luck. Thank you, John. We'll see you later. Dutch asked him to look into something to do with the Braithwaite horses, I think. Sure, okay. Okay, let's head out to the Braithwaite's place. You know the way? Um, yeah. Yeah, I've been there. So, what exactly are we doing? This is the moonshine we took after blowing up the Braithwaite still, right? I think the good citizens taking the trouble to return their stolen goods deserve some yeah. reward, don't you? And it's time we made a formal introduction, like the Dutch told us. Look, these are two big old plantation houses. All I keep hearing is they hate each other so much they can't see past it. I know. I've seen it. There's a great boy. And a Braithwaite girl carrying on a secret affair. I've been, well, helping them. <laughs> the mind boggles. <laughs> you think they're of use? Not sure. They don't seem too involved in the rest of it, but yeah. maybe. Well, I'm sure there's money in this for us somewhere if we can get in the middle of it. Hello, gentlemen. How are you? What's that in the back there? Moonshine, my fine fellow. May I have a word with the man of the house? The man of the house oh. is a lady. Mrs. Catherine Braithwaite. May I speak with her? I want to discuss a business opportunity. I mean no harm. No harm at all. You may happily shoot me if I do. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, she's at the house. Oh, right, you hitching a right, are you? We'll be okay. walking. Okay. You. you heard the man. Driver, okay. proceed, please. What a nice house. Look at the trees. Right, here we go. Okay. What you Ooh. want? Found something. Out in the hills. Thought, thought maybe you was in the market for it. For what? Some liquor. I ain't in the market for what's already mine. The way we see we it, it's found out. it. Oh, keepers. Possessing it, and I, I checked all over. For the life of me, I couldn't see your name on it. Ooh. Oh. Relax, I ain't here to rob you. <laughs> no, it seems that's easy enough. <laughs> Why not do a deal? What do you sell that stuff for? Dollar a bottle. You give us 50 cents. It's already ours. Now look on it as a reward for finding the property. Alternative is we go sell it someplace else. The alternative <laughs> is you get shot. Now, who wants to get shot over a bottle or two of liquor? <laughs> Pay the man. Thank you. Pleasure doing business with you. And listen, uh, we didn't take it, at least not without orders. From... Oh, I know exactly who gave you your orders. Old Sheriff Gray. You know what? I don't want it. In fact, sir, now you can do me a favor. There's an extra ten bucks if you do. Drive the stuff into Rhodes, head over to the tavern run by Mr. Gray, and give the stuff out for free. Mama! Hush now. I believe they call that a promotional expense. <laughs> As you wish, madam. You boys come back sometime and tell me how you made out. Maybe we'll play a little cribbage. All right, next stop, the road saloon. Here we go. <laughs> Is this a good 
good idea. It's like... So I finally sold those Cornwall bonds. Got close to a thousand Ooh, for them. I wanted more, but not bad considering how hot they were. Especially after that bloodbath yeah. in Valentine. No, not no. bad at all. Apparently, Cornwall's been pumping a lot of cash into the Pinkertons. Wants to keep their full effort on going after gangs. Gangs like us. Yeah. That don't surprise me. Oh, no, not yet. Oh, it was like hard right. here. This could get ugly. You and Dutch already have that thing going on in town with the sheriff. Yeah, Mr. Gray. That's it. Now we're inserting ourselves in his blood feud. <sighs> we'll need something. I ain't playing dress up. You know my feelings about that. Of course you're not. <laughs> you're you're a clown's. Idiot brother. Oh, I'm the clown. <laughs> You're the brother turned idiot. Just look sad and keep quiet. Even you can do that, Arthur. Oh, I have to. <laughs> Smoke this pipe. Uh. Bring your lip forward just a bit. Squint. Oh, perfect. Hey, what about you? <laughs> You can't speak. You're turned idiot. Right. Broke poor Mammy's heart. Uh, there, there, Fenton. There, there. Don't get mad now. Oh, 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 oh. Well, I wonder what he looks like. Okay, Fenton, stay calm now. For Mama, she loved you so. <laughs> Just a shame you had to strangle her in a rage, right? Grab two cases of that stuff and follow me. him don't madden him he's turned idiot <laughs> killed our mother but it weren't his fault how'd you boys how'd you boys like a couple of bucks i bet you would one for each of you sir. we're in the new trade of advertising which is an american art form about ensuring people buy the correct things i don't know one more dollar says give us half an hour what harm can we do in half an hour <laughs> go along now enjoy the money Come along, Fenton. Let's hand out the liquor. Oh, gosh. Gentlemen! Gentlemen! My name is Melvin. That's my brother Fenton. He's a bit funny, but boy, can he pour drinks fast. For the next 30 minutes, the drinks in this year bar, in this year town, are entirely free. Yeah. The only rule is that you gotta drink them. So hurry up, put old Fenton to work. Don't get him mad, though. His mama made him mad, and we buried him. The whole thing. Ah. Now come up to the bar, everybody. Come on, pull this in two.
That's our goddamn lick! An honest mistake! Boys, get him! Oh, oh my god, no!
Sorry, give me a sec. Don't think so. Over a few bottles of booze. Oh, I reckon wait. it's more they don't want another gang on their patch. Probably. Okay. Pull off the road here. All right. We're good. Yeah. Remind me never to take up a career. What was it? Advertising. Yeah. <laughs> you think that woman set us up? No, I don't think so. Maybe. This place is odd. Yeah, I keep seeing those fellas. Some local militia. Clearly not too happy to have some new competition. I'll go visit old Mob Braithwaite, see what's what. Why? We've been making money. The chest is filling up again, slowly but surely. Part of me thinks we just get ourselves good and lost. But we still need a lot more money before that can happen. So, for now... Let me go give old Mrs. Braithwaite some of this moonshine as, well, let's call it a peace offering. Sure. Okay. That was fun, Fenton. We'll make an actor of you yet. <laughs> I'll go speak to Dutch. That was funny. This place is weird. So what do you think? I don't what? Know. Fine folks around these parts. Oh, real nice. <sighs> exactly. Yeah. On the one side, we have got the Gray family. Scots, degenerates, drunkards, the local law. You couldn't make this stuff up. Rich as Croesus. And on the other, their mortal enemies, the Braithwaites. Moonshiners, hypocritical, both rolling, we believe. In gold. And in the middle of it all, you got some inbred retailing of Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so what you boys thinking? We try to rob them both. You sure? Why I'm not? Serious. Because we got lawmen in three different states after us. Last thing I want is to get us into trouble, but we need money. Now, we have the opportunity here to put ourselves in the middle of something ain't nobody gonna know we was here. Because even without us, these fools are gonna kill each other okay, anyway. Okay, well, Jose's gone back to see that Braithwaite woman. Good. Hosea should definitely take the lead on this. I sent Sean over to Braithwaite Manor, too. Now, you can meet up with them. Or join John and Javier at the Gray's place. Something to do with the Braithwaite's prize horses. Well, how the hell did we get in at the Gray's place? Sheriff Gray kindly put in a word with his father. It ain't that complicated. I feel bad. We've got to convince each family that we're on their side. And then we rob them both. Before they figure out it was us that done it, and not the other lot, we'll be long gone. Think of it as payback for my daddy. Payback. Mm. I ain't in the revenge business, Dutch. No. Least of all for something happened a long time ago. Well, I guess we all gotta pay for something. Now, if you will excuse me, Arthur, I got to write a letter. To who? I don't like this. Are you okay with her? So, who's that? Bill. Bill's got a mission. Let's get rid of that. Bill needs to speak to you. So dumb, back to Gamora. And then we can either go to the Brave Weights with Hosea or go to the Greys with John. I think probably we'll go to the Braithwaite's because I feel like they're a lot meaner than the Greys. You're beginning to creep me out, Arthur. What am I doing to you? I'm just standing here, right? Let me see. Touch. I'm going to my bed. Arthur! Stay what? away from me. Oh. But, but I got a tip. That's exactly what I'm afraid of. <laughs> oh, it's a goodie, I'm telling you. It always is with you. Then we end up hidden in a burning barn getting shot at. You're a sad man, Arthur Morgan. Sad man indeed. 
<laughs> I'm just funny. Um, oh, this is my account. Okay. Right. I'm going to change my clothing. Because I kind of... I quite liked what um, Lenny was wearing. Can I change the colour? Oh, I can. Oh, I didn't want to wear that. No, we'll just stay with that, right? Next. Right, I want to change my trousers. Wrench. There we go. Cool. Okay. Cuff town pants, jeans. Oh, they look like um cords. That's what they look like. What's the metal thing? The chaps. No chaps. Yeah, let's do that. <coughs> oh, we can go barefoot. Worn boots. Workman boots. Ooh, let's do you. Very nice. Oh, we have to like spurs. Nah. Masks. Okay, we'll just uh, walk around like that. Bandana, no. Neckwear, neck cheek, no. Gloves, no. Hmm. Or for satchel. Okay, I'll do. I think we look quite snazzy. See, saying again, honestly. Right, um, I am gonna end this here. Uh, those were quite fun missions. I quite, I really like Lenny. I think he's quite a fun character. Um, so I, I quite enjoyed that mission with him. He's just fun. I don't know what is up with Dutch. I'm wanting, <laughs> I'm wanting to rob both the families. Um, because we've got everybody after us, so I don't know if that's wise. But yeah, we'll just we'll end it here for the time being. Oh, he's got a picture of um, Mary Beth. Mary Beth, Mary. Oh, that's quite nice, right? Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, please subscribe, and I will see you next time.